Live from WSFA 12 News, this is your Doppler 12 Storm Vision Forecast from Chief Meteorologist Rich Thomas. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. One second. Yeah, I understand that. All right. Just, just let me know since we got it, okay? Thanks. That's uh, Ashley. She's our producer, and she's going to let, let us know when we have a beat on where Santa is, and uh, we'll be going to the Doppler 12 Storm Vision International mode in a moment. Well, here, this is the local Doppler 12 Storm Vision mode. Now, obviously, we're not going to see Santa Claus yet, but uh, as I mentioned, if you were with us earlier last hour, during the afternoon, we picked up some interesting radar returns as uh, Central and South Alabama had this kind of radar signature, and we think... Now, this is my theory. I think that Santa was making some reconnaissance runs through central and south Alabama just to get the lay of the land. He's a very careful guy. You know that whole scenario of making his list, checking it twice? That's Santa, and we're going to continue to keep you up to date on that. And by the way, for Santa and everybody else, here's your Christmas forecast, and it looks pretty typical for this time of the year with temperatures starting off in the low to mid-30s in the morning, ending up in the upper 50s, and then low 50s tomorrow night. It should be uneventful and pretty normal for this time of the year around our area. We've had a few high clouds coming through today, and that helped to keep the temperature way down. In fact, we only made the low 50s. We certainly would have made it a lot higher if we would have gotten some sunshine. Shine. These are temperatures right now from 46 in Evergreen, 45 in Montgomery, 48 in the Alexander City area, and 34 in Montgomery is the overnight low. 33. What's that? Ashley says we're ready to go now. Okay, let us go to uh, Santa uh, uh, Tracker 12. We're in the international tracking mode, and we're going to find out where Santa could be at this particular hour. Now, let's go over. He was over in Paris last hour. Oh, it looks like he's over in the United Kingdom right now in the general area around London. Moving off to the west, it should be uh, into the Ireland area of X and then Iceland. Now, later on tonight, we'll continue to watch this for you. If you're still up, kids, at 10 o'clock, we'll let you know where Santa could be. And don't forget, all throughout the evening, you can go to WSFA.com where we're tracking Santa for you on our Santa Tracker mode, and uh, we'll let you know what the latest information is. All right, back to the weather now, and you can see this upper level low, which doesn't have much moisture to work with, so it looks like a dry scenario for us. Maybe a few showers to the east of this into the southeast Atlantic coast area and a big storm system along the U.S. east coast. Meanwhile, our next best chance of rain would be later on Thursday into Thursday evening with the rain chances up to 50%, we think, by Thursday night. Out there right now, 45 degrees. Today's high was 52. Our low this morning, how about that, Santa? 25 was the low this morning. Humidity, 51%. No wind at the moment, and the barometer is falling. Our forecast on this Christmas Eve, and kids, I just pasted that up there. He's not there yet. He'll be, it's, it's a while. He'll be there in a few hours, you know. He's in London where it's 12, 16 right now. Uh, actually, he's in, yeah, the London area. 34 is the overnight low, near normal tonight. The winds are light. And then uh, looks like a nice holiday tomorrow across the area. Upper 50s, partly cloudy skies, and the winds out of the north at 5 to 10 miles per hour. On your Doppler 12 Storm Vision forecast, there's Christmas Day. There's the day after Christmas. We're looking for 32 first thing in the morning on Wednesday. Scattered showers, a good bet by... So let's say Thursday afternoon into Thursday night. Rain chances up to 50% by Friday and Saturday. And look at the temperatures, much milder, upper 60s by the weekend.